<laughs> you can start talking now. <laughs> I never start talking until they say so just. And then there's this there's this music that's playing right now. This is how we do it in America. So now I'll, I'd be like, welcome everybody to a special Legion's cast. All right. Here we are on a Saturday morning. We are in anxious bunch of fellas waiting to see what the, the new figure obscura for May of 2024 is going to be. Mm. Uh, we had a drop earlier this week with some clues. Uh, or a clue or, or a little bit, you know, I don't even pay attention to much anymore. I don't care. Uh, I'm going to buy this <laughs> because <laughs> I just, I'm going to buy it. I don't either, you know, I'll see, I'll see what it is after it drops and, uh, and after everything is secured. So, um, but anyways, guys, we've got what, eight minutes or so until it drops. Yeah, that's a lot of minutes. That's a I'm lot eager. Of minutes. I'm sorry, I'm not saying anything. I'm 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 checking my uh, situation here. I like the setup, <laughs> my phone, so I'm ready to rock and roll. And and if anyone, I'm not giving away my secrets. I was going oh, you... to. I was all prepared to like tell all everyone out there, like my secrets to um, success on these kind of drops, but I'm not doing it. I think that's a wise oh. move. I thought you'd like that. It's a wise move. Let people earn it. <laughs> Emil, how excited yeah. are you for this? How excited are you? Are you more excited for... Oh, no, for... I forgot something. Hold on. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> oh he's, he just hit the brakes. Yeah, just he when you like... were talking about something. In... Yeah. yeah. I was going somewhere. He was like the uh, <laughs> the driving is in, uh, instructor that has the brake on the passenger side of the car, and he just slammed it. Yeah, or so if someone is gonna tell a story and it's just about so the story was like this and the person like oh let me tell me let me tell you about something real funny. I was like, no, I just started my story. Oh hello. <laughs> hey Len. Hey, I forgot my credit card. <laughs> oh. Oh Len is really down to business here. He is like uh, he this is like filming a gorilla in the wild. We're seeing we're seeing Len uh pre uh financial uh yeah uh, setting up here to, to to purchase this figure and he's he's not his brain is not on the show i can tell he's yeah. swinging from tree to tree i don't mess and, around buddy see I, i'm going I, for a, i'm going for the all-in and the all-ins have always been a little tricky you know they'll sell out in under five minutes and and i feel like as the you never know how many they're going to be available you never know. You never know. I think if you get on it right away, I think if you get on it right away, you'll be able to get it. Whether I, you're using lens tricks. I missed it in the past while going on right at it. Have you? I think it was Father Christmas. I, I missed the all in. I and then too. I got, yeah, And then I got the, uh, you know, another Father Christmas instead. And, and then for the, the second drop, they had uh, the all ins again. And I was like, oh, maybe I should have waited for this, but you know, because yeah. I never ordered, uh, never got around to order a cup or, you know, mug. Um, so the only old in that I have in my possession is the Sun Wukong, but that is also my absolute favorite one. Yeah, you and like that? You like the water bottle, the water mug, like it, the plastic mug? I think it looks great, but it leaks. Oh, it does. I never used it. I don't. I, yeah, I use it a lot, but it's it leaks. Yeah. So if, if you drop it, even if it's closed, you're gonna oh no, it's gonna be water everywhere. Yeah, Th that's sort uh, you know. But I still use it. Um, I only drink water from 1986 era Pizza Hut plastic glasses. <laughs> What's so funny? I like that. <laughs> you know the you know what I'm talking about, Steve, right? Yeah. Yeah, yep. you know what I like is there used to be Smucker's Jelly. Oh, yeah. They used to came in these glass things with dinosaurs on them, like pictures of little I cartoons. know exactly what you're talking about. That's good and for your I, orange juice in the morning. 
Yeah, your, my mom, she, she saved them and used them as glasses, and she still has them. And so when I go to her house, I drink out of them, and I they feel like a little kid again. <laughs> Those are the smaller ones, right? The yeah, little, they're not very big. Yeah, they're good to portion, like the the high sugar drinks with. <laughs> high sugar drinks that'll give you diabetes in the future. Exactly. So if any, I will tell you my strategy. What I do is I go to, I go to. Don't do it. All right. Do it. No. This isn't live though, so I'm not really going to give away any kind of secret for. You will for next today. time. Yeah, that's true. And then you're not going to be able to. Why make it harder on yourself, Len? You're 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 an enterprising man who figured out the hack. I don't know if it's even really a hack. It's actually <laughs> kind of because I know what he's talking about. And it's it's kind of common sense. I probably yeah, should ask both correct. of you before the show, you know, because. Well, you know what, you know, you know, they used to have that, um, like they used to have the, um, shop app used to work on the site and it really was one click. And I used to get a lot of stuff like with that, like it was like, you would just literally throw the stuff in your cart, one click done. But now the shop app doesn't work anymore. So you have to be a little more, a little more, what's the word I'm looking for on top of things. Man, we're three minutes out, boys. I'm refreshing already. Like something's gonna happen. <laughs> I, I mean, okay, okay, so, okay. Three minutes in, Stephen. W- what are we getting? And are we gonna know in three minutes? But for now, what what do you think? What are we gonna? What are we getting? Uh, I'm not very creative when it comes to guessing these things. They said something about a rap or something in one of it. So I'm assuming in and there's a hier- hieroglyphics uh, thing. So this has got to be a mummy of some sort. It's but I mean. Be. Look up in the top corner. That's a dog. And I love dogs. Yeah. There's a man and a dog. Actually. There's a man and a dog. This, this was made for me. You already have a tribute figure, so it can't be for you. <laughs> and to the left, we have someone sitting at a chair and looking at an orb of some kind. Right? And a man in a, in a bathtub. With a light lamp on top of him. A man in a bathtub with a light. Yeah. Yeah, I guess that's I see what it. That is. I see it. He's got does big that man have stick- a beard? <laughs> He's got big yeah, feet he does. sticking out of the tub. Yeah. And in the middle, we have, um, you know, two people in robes. They're getting advice from a droid from Clone Wars. So it could be a cosmic. <laughs> I, I would not put, oh, we're one minute out. I wouldn't put it past Jeremy to, to kind of swerve with this, like, tease. Like, I'm not I'm not expecting a mummy, to be honest with you. Some pharaoh kind of thing? I don't know. It might not even be Egyptian. Oh, it could be a Nefertiti or Cleopat- Cleopatra or something. Cleopatra. There were a lot of people in the cabal that were really looking for a female figure for that, you know, a 2.0 type. So that would definitely be interesting. And it is kind of like time. I think I'm going to have to be cool and not just click, click and buy, click and buy. I think I'm going to, I don't know. I don't even know what I'm going to do. I never know what I'm going to do until I see it. Oh, I did that too early. Oh, you, you know what? Oh, now it's out. Just... It's out. It's out. I'm not seeing it. It is out. Yep, there it is. See you later. Holy. They are cool. Oh, yeah. And so, people, what, what? I mean, these two gentlemen are clicking and clicking on. And I. I, I'm the only flat, one who doesn't have this nine, in my flat cart. rate nine ninety nine shipping. Yeah, no, do, yep. do you have that? Yeah. Uh, well, I will. I will not be able to have that. So, not jealous. Not jealous. Just saying. Got it. Something went wrong. All right, I got the all in. I'm good. Uh, mine's pro- I got it too. 
You good, I Steve? got an all in too, and I don't know what it is yet. What All right, is let's it? look now. Let's look at it. That's going to be okay. the fun part, right? Let's see. Emil, are you, oh. are, are, Emil, are you okay to look at it yet? Yeah, well, well I, I didn't buy it. So, wow, oh, look at that. Holy it's, smokes. It's a two pack. Is that a, that's a two pack? That's a two pack. It's a two dog pack. person. It looks like a two pack, but it's in two separate boxes. Look at that. See, Steve, you see oh, that? Oh, Anubis and Bastet. Wow, Bastet. holy hell. Bastus. Look at that. Dude, that is crazy town. Look at the feet. It, Look at the feet. Ooh, monster feet. Emil, you see the feet? I see the feet. I see the feet. I see Does that the get you all moist in your nethers? <laughs> I, I'm not going to use that word, but you... you Look at you, this. Oh, okay. Look at all that stuff. That's some stuff. Holy Look at that. Hell. There's a lot of extra heads there. There's a head dress thing. Oh, wait a minute. That was just for one character? Yeah, so this is this must be the extras with one of them. And oh, so here's the have... extras with the other one, with the Bast one, with the Bastet, the uh, cat. Wait a minute. There are, Look at all that stuff, Beautiful man. cat heads. Holy animal. Like, we're going to... This is this is custom this is custom part rich okay, man. Okay, not okay. Not only awesome, but holy okay. look at this. Custom part rich, but it's also, you know, it's not a cheap buy. So no, it's hard. Look, it's got... always hard for me to wow. customize. Ooh, I love those that. are they're, those are bands that they're sculpted in, right? Oh yeah, well that's a, oh, a Those that's... those lower arms for the female, that gets me excited. How many can I get? I want as many as possible, you know, without big uh, you know um gauntlets and gauntlets and stuff yes legion's purse first time ever legion's purse <laughs> and it's an... at soft goods let me see something here you can't... Oh, so... i knew it look human feet too okay i, I knew they were oh, gonna do well, that they're new new right then for 2.0 right yeah there's, there's no a 2.0 human two... feet and right. they're new because we have no way the past. Had... Well, she has yeah, yeah. but she, doesn't she have claws doesn't alithia have no i think there she... are i thought her nails were really long what about the the chick um orc leader girl wait a minute is that a staff she had she had regular feet right she so we... I used okay. them on an orc. Oh, wait a minute we have both claw hands and yeah, you got the claw hands and regular hands. So you could basically do they, both with this. Uh, There's no I, humanoid head. cat heads? Yeah, apparently. So can you uh, look at the male parts again? Yeah. The extra part for the male. You have like a pharaoh's crown, a canoptic jar. And you bare feet as well. Those are not the same as the current one the big barbarian ones a canoptic jar what the heck yeah is that even, what, how do you even know what that's called how do you not haven't you seen the mummy or anything you don't watch no, any i'm not <laughs> not really yeah. oh wow yeah that's a that's a lot of onk <laughs> lots these? of like little dio pieces That dog is mean. That you think this is where the secret surprise is? Oh, of course, I yeah. Oh, is. and then there was a secret surprise in both ones? I bet you that's where the secret surprise is. This, there's an, I think this, there's an Otho in there for everybody. <laughs> this Bastet <laughs> statue looks pretty big on the base. It might be like, it might open at the bottom. Or maybe not. They may only do one surprise. Okay, okay. look the at the head. Oh, okay, yes. What do you want me to look at? I was, I'm, I'm going to... Just I want to bring room. up the main website. And yeah, see please. He, he I want to look at the male up. figure. We haven't looked at that really good yet. We haven't. We looked at the female. We didn't look at the male. Wasn't that the, there was a problem with the site? There was, but it looks like it's okay. I know. Um, um, I know that our buddy is at the um, the show today. The um, what is that? Figure, uh, Shop the Curiosity in Connecticut. So they were actually going to have these at the table. And the show opened at 9. 
and they're going to have these at the table. And the tricky part is that Jeremy had to get this website rocking and all this stuff done at nine from the Wait, show. I just assumed that oh. this stuff was set on a timer, like it just drops no, at nine on a map. No, you have to like, you have to do it. It's the same like when I do our website. It's the same thing. I don't see it on the main website. He, he, he might just be having issues with that. So the old in is uh, still available. Is it really? Yeah. Wow. Oh, Six yeah. minutes in. Now I decided I don't want it because it's still well, let's, available. Let's, let's there's no at, fear of there's no FOMO in it now because I can get it. So now I don't want it. And I, I won't want that. And I will not want the all in until it sells out. This looks like a nice mug, Steve. This looks like a porcelain I, mug. It does. I like that. I like that. I think I think it does. Yeah, it has both sides. Do you, do you collect the pins as well? I do. I have them uh, right here. I don't know if you can see it, but I have them all up here on a board with with all my other pins. I'll, let's look at the pins. Nice, nice pins. Those are cool. Now, I've heard of Anubis before, but I've never heard of Bestat. Have you guys? Yeah. Sure. Yeah. I'm I'm so, well read, Stephen. I'm not in this in the mummy thing. I'm really <laughs> not. I like there's been multiple third party Anubis heads made. I have only painted one because somebody commissioned me to do so. I I I've just never been a guy that's like, I want a guy with a dog head. And um I mean So are those think, the, the the same lower legs that um, uh, the Gaspar figure is coming with? You are the master at that, buddy. I would I see it looks are, so. I think they are, and so that would be the standard then that they are slightly bigger. You know, maybe perhaps for you know uh, stability purposes or something. The lower I, legs. Yeah. They don't yeah. look they don't look as thick on this because they don't have the bands, I think. They don't have Those the wraps around them. Yeah. So they look more like you know more just muscular. muscular. They're yeah. still big muscular calves. What's going on with this torso, Emil? So all it's new. a a a waist piece that's going up all over the the chest. Are you I think sure? That's part of the sculpt. Are you sure? The, the that is so you're saying, your guess is that's a bear that's a bear chest torso with a piece coming up. No, no, no. I think it's part of the chest piece. That's my guess. Yeah, but that's a, so that's a new that's a brand new. Yeah, as well thing. as the upper arms and the lower arms as well. Unless unless the the rings are sitting very tight, I think they're. It's part probably of the, the new. It's it's probably the new Atlas body parts. Remember, he said he resculpted all of the muscles and stuff for Atlas. Yeah, they don't but, look like the norm, does it? But look at those armbands. If those are separate pieces, how can they? They, they, they look great. Mm. They look very tight. They don't look like you know something that would be on top of. I don't know if this gives you any more look. That this right here that looks like it's part of the arm to me and not a separate piece. Yeah, it's very thin otherwise. Yeah. and I think that's a great move. Okay, okay. The the the. the, the um, the parts, I mean, now we're, we, we, we've talked about the great characters, you know, but we're also looking at all the parts. Oh, can you look at her lower legs? Oh. Wow. I wonder how many you can get. <laughs> Honestly, I'm not kidding. I love that ad. Yeah. I'll I tell like you that. what, in, in all honesty... I've always wanted to do the Anubis head, and I know it's been done before from third party, yeah. but they always break. There's like huge breakage issues, and it was one of those parts in the back of my head that was like, "Well, if we ever get this injection mold, it good because I don't ever have to do it." And it looks like we did, so that's cool. Yeah. And I, I love the headdress on it. I, like that's how I would display this right there is with that yeah. head and that. Yeah. Let me see if I can find this. I wonder if the wristbands are actually loose pieces. I think that that's quite possible that they are. I agree, yeah. And then I would... It could be that the lower... You know, the, the rings on the lower legs also 
comes off. I'm not as sure about those. They, they look I tight. would think so. You think so? Yeah. They, yeah it's not... extremely impressive if they come off. It would be a waste, wouldn't it, to make those... To, to, yeah. to have that part yeah. put I into think production that off. for one... I'm just saying, if they come off, then that's super impressive because it's they, co- they it's covering the uh, joint a lot there, yeah, really well. And, so I think that they do come off, and that is something that we, you know, always give a high praise for the legions figures um, and obscura figures, you know, for horsemen figures. Still, one of the things that I love, one of the top things I love about the line, all the hidden joints. Yeah. Um, and so I'm just. Uh, can you look at the different cat heads? Yeah. Let's go to uh, here. So there. Are, there. Are, oh wow! That might be my favorite that you're hovering over. It looks like they they really just have different levels of ornateness right like the the gold yeah, applications different there are also two different sculpts no yeah, you know what also that you i think the two to the right uh are used with a headpiece and then the or or if it's the two to the left and then the, you can use the same ones without the headpiece well it's yeah you're it's two different sculpts right like yeah. so we're seeing the, one with the like two a ones to the right. thicker muzzle in the front and one with a thinner that is one thing that they're two different sculpts, but they're two versions of each sculpt. You know, uh, one that you don't need the headpiece is my guess, and one that you put the headpiece on. Yeah, I can. And that. I like that. Yeah. I like that a lot. You know that that one goes with a. My you guess don't think the headpiece that you don't think the headpiece fits on all four of them. No, I don't. I do. I think it looks like the same shape. Mm-hmm. In the back. I think the back of the head is missing on the ones to the right. Oh, you think that's like a straight drop? I don't know. This one that I'm on right now with the scarab in the forehead looks like it's rounded down the back. Yeah, but I see what you're saying yeah, on this one. I think that like one's meant drop. to be without the headpiece. Exactly. The ones on the right look like they're cut out in the back to me. It's not the same shape. It's just like, it, think of it as the Monkey King removable faceplates. You had a two different expressions. One was meant to... Yeah, but this this one on the right, like, why would you put all that gold ornateness on the top Because of it, it would look better with uh, that piece. But it's going to get covered up. No, I don't think so. I think, I think that's what you go behind the gold. Oh, let, me, let me look if I see pictures of her with the headpiece. Well, here you go. So, yeah, so it drops off. It's pretty far back, so you're right. So that's more of you think that's more of like a half head. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I can see that from this this picture. Okay, show us something else. Packaging's nice. Beautiful packaging. Oh, here we didn't look at this picture. This is her again. You know Come all on. those. Look at those legs and arms. I'm, I'm absolutely blown away. <laughs> Look at her thing. Would you date? Would you date a woman like that if she had feet like that? Yeah. I mean, because she's hot, but she's you know I don't know if I like the the claw feet. <laughs> well, she comes with human feet. Thank God. <laughs> it's like, would you mind changing feet before we go out on this date? That's. Like... <laughs> That's a horrible thing. No, don't, don't. Otherwise, you, you, you respect the woman and you. <laughs> <laughs> Having those claw feet is great around the house, but I don't want to be seen and outside with those. My guess is also, you know, that, um, uh, you know, I think that both torso pieces could be new or it could be Lithia's lower piece. Oh, it's definitely a Lithia's. But not the right. top. The top is not the Lithia. I'm saying no. it's not. So, and the the bottom Doesn't piece. Doesn't have a black wrap bra top? Her her top looks different. Well, okay. I heard I, I heard I... the annoyment in your head. Who me? <laughs> but, it's, 
but but and oh no no i hit the microphone i know i trust you because you rip these apart all the time i i don't i elicia elicia's torso is also bigger than usually you know 2.0 torsos so my hope is that this upper torso oh that's a beautiful tail that the top part is more fit to 2.0 pieces instead of Elithias that is a little bit bigger to of course accommodate for her uh, big hair and, and all the extra arms that's cool they both have tails more tails as options are always good oh and they're bendy wires yeah yes they are has that, wow has that classic uh, whole, whole pattern that the bendies have I actually think I I need that for a special reason. <laughs> I love how a meal immediately is you. There's some nice you, calves. Look at those calves, Steve. Yeah. yeah. You both know that we we're, we're looking at these wonderful figures and, and and loving them, but then you can't help but you know, oh my god, I need that lower arm or that. <laughs> this is gonna be so much fun. Uh, it looks like the soft goods aren't like a stark white you know they have that like kind of tea stain or right. um, parchment look which is cool there you go buddy i just uh, we uh, there's the it, limit it, to 12 sets per person what did you say it says this is limited to 12 sets. look at reading the red this is limited to 12 sets per person sale drop at this time yeah oh wait so you can buy 12 of these buddy They'll evaluate that, I'm sure, by the second drop to see, you know, if that needs to stay or not. But, but twelve uh, usually hasn't it in the past been two. Yeah. So they must. Have... I thought they didn't limit at all. They they, they always limit them on Marley. I think there was two limit. Are you sure? I don't uh, think maybe, there was. Maybe not. At one point in Figure Obscure, there was two. There. Was oh two yes, limit. Steve, you're absolutely right. In at one point, but I don't think they've been putting limits. Maybe on the all in, but not on. Not on the general figures, I don't think. Um, now, now it's uh, it's sold out. The all, the all in is right, and the mug, and the mug. But you can still get the figure. Yes, and we are for you, those of you at home. It is nine eighteen, so it's eighteen minutes. Um, ish. I mean, it could have yeah. that we noticed it, or that Emil noticed it. And here I've been just looking at the figures instead of. Um, it looks ordering. like um, it looks like it's still not up on the main website. Oh, it booted me out. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Hmm. StreamYard won't share um, this because it could tell it's a login page. No. So what you're seeing is not what's on my screen. Why did I get logged out, though? That's weird. I. You can actually order that many. Or, I mean, 12. <laughs> I'm, no, I'm just... <laughs> What is that? Uh, 12, 12 uh, times 120. No, yes. 12 times 120 is what that's. $1,440? Yeah. Right? That's what it came up with. So it appears. Oh, it's now, right in front of me. I'm stupid. I'm not going to pretend like you can't do. Like, it. Can't, people don't do it. But you know how we see people always reporting on how many's left on things? In the cabal. Yes. I, you can't do that trick because it's limit 12. So it's not it's it's like bypass it's not letting you So it's interesting that Bastet has uh, two different versions of the head and Anubis has one. I bet there is a reason for that. No, actually Bastet has two different heads but one of the heads have two different poses, you know, open and closed. Um Wow. I wonder what the reaction is. Well, a couple of my um, group 
threads that I'm in is blowing up, and so far everybody is saying they love it. But I haven't gone to the Cabal or anything like that. So I'm spending time with you here. <laughs> yeah, you're so noble. <laughs> That's so noble of you to share your time with us as well. <laughs> yes. Do you guys want to take predictions about what's in this box? I don't uh, see what the point is. I mean, okay, so Why was there a reason? It's still not sharing the... Yeah. What was there? I mean, for Jacob Marley, the head that was in the safe, uh, did that have any connection? No. No, no connection cool. to the story. No, that it was, was just, just cool. cool. It was just a cool al alternate head Got for it. like a cool figure. I think we so, get a cool mommy head. You know what I think? Oh, that's a good idea. Yeah. I, I was thinking kind of like a skeleton pharaoh head. Like a, you know what I mean? Like, a, like the, I think of like Iron Maiden, like, you know, like the Eddie, like yeah. not that exactly, but kind of like a more like darker, you know, type of alt head for it. I think it's a hand painted Kitsune by Jeremy Gerard. <laughs> oh, yeah. he, he's a busy man. He could knock that out before 4 a.m. though. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, another thing with the box art, um, Nate Barch, it feels like he's going bananas and trying something new again. You know, I think he's re my guess is that he's really enjoying doing different kind of styles for these boxes. I know he, he talked about it in the past, but it's how how to how to get the pieces look so Egyptian. But yeah. also modern in a way. If you uh... ah, here we go. Yeah, that's cool. There we go. Is that? If, I see, don't if even I, really if I pay like... attention, I can share bigger pictures. <laughs> I don't even really like Egyptian stuff that much. Like it's not my thing. But I, this is cool enough that I'm just like, yep, I'm I, I'm fine with it. Yeah. Uh... Oh, it wow. didn't work. It's not working for the tests. Yeah, I am. Um... You want me to bring here? I'll bring up the front cover if I can. Hold on. Nope, I can't. Wow. <laughs> They're not it gets so... This opens up so many doors for future figures and future ideas. Um... <laughs> Just. <laughs> Um, there's really not much of a write-up. I was thinking I could read something about it, but there's really not. So, sorry. No book. Oh, here we go. It looks like it's up on the site now. Let's go share this tab instead. The time of the gods. Oh wow. Should I read this? <laughs> Wish I had AI to read this. <laughs> Have a good voice, Len. Read it. Stemming from prehistoric religious beliefs, the first evidence of deities in Egypt came from around 3100 to 2868 BC, a time known as the early dynastic period. Artwork from this time depicts a wide variety of human and animal figures. This artwork eventually evolved to resemble many of the gods which would populate the pantheon of this religion. Many of the deities worshipped by the people of ancient Egypt represented elements of the natural world, such as the sun god Ra, or immortal aspects of life and society. Death and the afterlife were important aspects of Egyptian society, and a number of the gods and myths of this time center on the passage between life and death. Depictions of the gods of ancient Egypt, many of whom bore the heads of animals, were often meant to illustrate aspects of the deity's characters, character or duties. These gods were worshipped by ordinary people as part of their daily lives, as well as through official religious practices and ceremonies. In these ceremonies, statues of the gods were anointed and presented with gifts as songs and were sung to encourage the deities to remain generous to the people of Egypt. 
Belief in these gods and the practices for honoring them began to wane in the 3rd century AD. The last formal cults of the religion died out sometime in the 5th or 6th century, yet aspects of their worship practice would be adapted by other religions. Evidence of these gods and the beliefs of these ancient people would be found many years later through the discovery of temples and tombs and in the form of sculptures and paintings. Our modern, our modern understanding of this time comes from these discoveries, and the depictions of these gods stem from the surviving artwork of the civilization. Wow, that's right. a lot of things to read. That's, that was just the start. That's just the start. Yeah, then we, meet, we do meet the gods, which is um, a little write-up about Anubis and kind of like his historical stance, meaning there's a lot. Um, and then it gets into... I'm not, I'm, I think I've, I've heard it just said as Bast, but yeah, it reads like Bastet. So I don't know which is honestly right if it's Bast or Bastet. And it gets into um, her, and then it talks more about Figure Obscura. Huh. Well. Okay. Pretty cool, fellas. Have you figured out what you're going to do, Emil? No, I am not. I'm not. I'm honestly not. I, you know, as usually, I don't click the all in by, you know, by default. But I probably should. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm, I'm not, I'm not a big pin collector, you know? Here it says to create Anubis, Eric decided that he wanted to resculpt the entire 1.0 bare body. In fact, some of the barbarian parts that were first seen publicly in the Mythic Legion's Rising Sun Wave were actually sculpted months earlier with the Anubis project. For the head of Anubis, Eric created three distinct looks, including two that were more realistic animal heads and one which was based on statuary and artistic depictions of this god those head along with options to display the god with either human or animal feet give this figure a nice variety of options so not only Sorry. is this a really cool figure obscure it's going to be our first chance to get our hands on the new barbarian body yeah yep. i am um, i'll read I, the the bast one real quick just because i think it's interesting maybe you will too for for Bass, the original idea for the figure was to utilize mostly existing tooling from our 2.0 library of parts. Of course, once Eric began working on the character, he found himself inspired and excited. Rather than making use of the existing library, he resculpted this figure as well. The torso began with the one first created for the myth this mythic legions Alithia figure. It was adjusted to create Bast for the arms and legs. Eric sculpted brand new limbs. Some of these new parts would also be seen first in the Rising Suns wave, specifically for the arms used on the Manisha Cinderhorn figure. Like Anubis, Bast also came with a few display options, including a removable headdress and portraits in both the realistic style, like Anubis, and a more st statuary version of the Mother of Cats. So... Even the arms are new. I mean, we know the arm. Uh, Stephen, when you ask me if I've decided what to do, it's not like I'm thinking if I will get this or not. That is not a question that is in my head. The only question is how many. How many? Yeah. How many? Because this is too much awesomeness. I like her carpet beater. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Huh? All right, fellas. We're at been on for about forty minutes or so. You think that's yeah. probably good enough? I yeah. think so. I mean, okay. I got work to do. Oh look, T shirts. Oh, I'm sure t-shirts will be available at Retro Rags. Yeah. Check out Retro Rags. Get your t-shirt. Beautiful. All right. Go ahead, Steve. Uh, all right, guys. Awesome. Fun Sunday, Saturday morning. 
uh, for those of you at home. Hope good luck on getting. Uh, hope you got what you wanted. And if not, there I'm sure there's a there's a tonight time. Is there a, is there another time? Uh, there is a there is a second drop, but I'm not really sure. Um, I I don't know the time. I'm gonna I'm not gonna okay. lie. I think it's usually <laughs> eight o'clock. But um, anyway. We'll see if this sells out before the second drop, anyways, because I think I think I think in the past there's been times where it hasn't sold out before then, and in more recent uh, figure obscuras, I know the first one sold out like crazy. But yeah, thanks for joining us. I uh, hope you enjoyed watching us do our thing. Yep, and we'll be back with a new episode of Legion's Cast soon. This Thursday. This Thursday. This Thursday. Okay. <laughs> Until then, we'll see you around the lands of Mythos and Cosmerium. Bye. Bye-bye, everyone.